Oh my goodness, this is so weird. Hi guys, it's me, Skull Queen, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. And I know it's me in the flesh on camera. I don't know if I like it. This is really weird for me. Excuse any weird settings or like colors going on. I don't know what I'm doing. I just Googled 10 different tutorials on how to set this up. So hopefully we're okay. I don't know if any of this is gonna work, so fingers crossed. But to give you a little intro, if you've been following me here on YouTube, then you know that I've been exclusively posting Animal Crossing videos. And I still do plan on posting Animal Crossing here and there when I get inspired. But the thing is, I've just been really, really burnt out on Animal Crossing. And I know a lot of you guys have to. The truth of it is we haven't received any updates in the past year and a half with no updates coming in sight and once you've seen all the items, I don't know, I've made five different islands at this point, you know, it's just very repetitive and that's why I've decided to film my very first video on The Sims 4. So a little backstory on me, I've been a Sims fan since I was in middle school. I remember playing it with my friend when I went to visit her in Texas for like two weeks straight day and night and that was the sims 2 i don't think i ever played the sims 1 i might have been a little young for that i definitely played sims 3 though and now sims 4 so i figured it's just full circle it's my new obsession and let's get started with what we're going to be doing today i have decided to start the 100 baby challenge in the sims 4 and if you aren't aware of what this challenge is let me go over a few of the rules quickly and this rule guide was posted by Snarky Sims. I'll have it linked in the description if you want to look over it yourself or possibly do this challenge with me. Let's do it together. The base game Sims 4 is actually completely free to download right now, so just putting that out there. But for the 100 baby challenge, here are the goals. So as I'm sure you can guess, the goal is to have 100 babies in as few generations as possible. We cannot use the same dad twice and we can't move any of the dads in to help us out. Deadbeat dads, right? So essentially, I just have to start out with a young adult Sim. Once she becomes an elder, then her youngest daughter at the time will take over as the matriarch. I'm allowed to pick any personality or traits for my matriarch that I would like. However, if I move her into a lot with some existing traits, I cannot change those and once I do pick traits for a lot those are permanent they cannot be changed ever again it does say that I have to play with aging on and set to a normal lifespan we're also not allowed to use any cheats mods or CC that give an unfair advantage so literally the only cheat I'm gonna be using is the bb.move objects so I can decorate freely, but we're not gonna be using any money cheats, anything else, that's it. And here's a few of the rules about our children. So newborns can only be aged up once they hit their natural birthday. Infants can be aged up once they've tried all the baby foods and they have to have either a happy infant or a top notch trait. Now, if I fail this challenge, that is gonna be the reason. Because if I have seven babies running around, you think they're all gonna be top notch? I don't think so. <laughs> so I think if I'm gonna fail, it's gonna be because of the infant stage. So hopefully not, we'll see though. Toddlers can be aged up once they've reached level three in all of the toddler skills. Children and teenagers can be aged up once they receive an A in school. And once the children become young adults, they can be moved out of the house to make room for some more babies. And of course, we're not allowed to kill off any Sims or if they get taken by social services, they're not gonna count towards the 100 babies. So you have to raise them from infancy to adulthood on your own. It also says that we're not allowed to influence the gender or the traits of any of our children. It all has to be completely random. There's really a lot of parameters parameters and things here. So if you want to check out these rules for yourself, it's going to be linked down in the description for you. So be sure to look over that if you're so inclined and maybe do this challenge with me. With all of that being said, I think it's time to stop procrastinating and start our challenge. So let's go. Right, so here we are in The Sims 4 and let's start this challenge. So we're gonna start a new game. 
All right, and we're not gonna do the personality quiz, but we do need to change him to a female. Whoa, those are some eyebrows, girl. Wow, I do not know about this hair. This is a little cray cray. I really like this hair, but these eyebrows, my goodness. Oh, she has a little tattoo. That's kind of cute. I think I'm gonna leave that. I like the idea of her being a little kind of punky, maybe a little gothic, something different than the typical baby mama, you know? Ooh, this smoky eye is gorgeous. Oh yeah, I love this more vampy look. I think this is super cute. Look at her, okay. I love dark eye makeup. I don't even care. All right, here is what she looks like. I think she is adorable. I love the more vampy dark look. I wonder why. <laughs> And we have to name her. So her name is gonna be Baby. Can you guess it? That's right, Baby Mama. <laughs> so, and she is a she and okay, so let's see what we want her personality to be like. I feel like it only makes sense to make her family oriented somehow. So do we want a big happy family or a super parent? I'm gonna say super parent. Hopefully that means her parenting skill will go up quickly and then we can get our baby's skills up quicker. That is the goal. So likes and dislikes, I'm not going to worry about. We'll let that be random. And for her traits, she's going to have to be romantic because she's going to be flirting it up with a hundred different dads. Okay. And then for her other trait, let's see. Oh yeah. We're going to make her family oriented for sure. I want something to do with creativity because she's probably going to be an author since she cannot leave the house. I think I'm just going to make her a bookworm and hopefully that helps out with the writing books. I'm not too sure. But she is so cute. Look at baby mama. Oh my goodness. She's a super parent who's romantic, family oriented, and a bookworm. Super cute. So we're going to save her. All right. Time to move her out into the world. Let's do this. Uh, where should she live? Mm, maybe Newcrest? We'll do one of these smaller lots. Maybe this one that's 2,000. We're gonna confirm. So we have 18,000 simoleons left to our name and we need a whole house. <laughs> So let's see how we're gonna do this. You know, I think I'm just gonna go into the gallery and download something. I know there has to be some 100 baby homes out there somewhere. Here we go. Okay, I'm just gonna type 100 baby and see what comes up. I also don't have any of the expansions for this game except for the go to work one and I think the magic kit or something like that. So I really don't have a lot of the extended gameplay here. So we're gonna have to work with what we have. So let's see what kind of homes we have here. What is this? This seems like a promising choice. We have a nice open floor plan, some baby rooms. Okay, I could work with that. Let's see what else. This one is cute. Ooh, okay. This is a nice floor plan. Lots of bedrooms. We have our master, a kitchen, and it's 17,000. <gasps> We're gonna have like 31 simoleons left to our name. Oh my gosh, okay. All right, yeah, let's just, let's do it. Why not? Ooh, should I do a furnished or unfurnished? I don't know if I really like the colors going on in here. For the sake of time, I'm just gonna do furnished and we can always change things later. Here is our house. How cute is it? Oh my gosh. Ah, our first home. Probably our only home if I'm being honest, but we're gonna have a hundred babies in here. I can't believe it. How do we see if there's any lot traits? <gasps> there's no traits. Okay, so let's pick some. Okay, so the homey trait can help you master cooking, mixology, handiness, and gardening. Okay, so we want that because I'm sure things are gonna be breaking like crazy. I wish there was something about learning kids' skills quicker. Okay, so fast internet can help improve programming, video gaming, and writing skills. That sounds good, so we'll do that. I'm just gonna do science layer. Hopefully it helps the kids learn quicker. I don't know if that's gonna actually help anything, but. But we're gonna see. So with that, we have baby mama, we have our house. I think it's time to start playing. And the first thing on the agenda is of course gonna be finding a baby daddy. So I think we have to go travel somewhere unless I see some
somebody just like roaming the streets, which I highly, highly doubt. We're just gonna travel and see who we meet. So let's go. I know the perfect place to meet men and that's the gym. So we're gonna go to the gym. All right, who wants to be the first dad in my life? Ooh, Rylan. Hi, Rylan. Friendly introduction. Let's say hello. Do you wanna have my babies? I mean, um, you wanna hang out for a little bit? There are people just spawning out of thin air right now. Come back. Who are you? Brent Hecking. Hi. All over. Oh, he went in. He went into the gym. Oh my gosh. Okay. Funny introduction. Let's say hello. Why is it pancakes? All of these are my men. You have to get your butt out of here. Jay Huntington the third? Oh my goodness. All of these sweaty men. Oh, he looks like he is struggling just a little bit. You okay, my dude? <laughs> I don't know if he's okay. Stop talking to Eliza Pancakes. No, you need to work out with Jay. You need to give him a compliment. What are you doing? Baby, oh my God, baby mama is just working out. She's not talking to anyone. Okay, no, you have to, you gotta flirt. She did one rep of one weight set and has a fitness skill. If only it was that easy for me. <laughs> Ooh, okay, so we have like three eligible bachelors here. Who is the most available? I think it might be Brent. So we're gonna give him a compliment. Okay, stop talking to all of them. Just talk to Brent. Check in on Brent. She's like, look at you go. You're running so fast. You look so nice and sweaty. All right, who do we like? Can I make Eliza go? Can you just leave? Ooh, Jay Huntington's done. Okay, let's tell him a funny story. Give him a compliment. Why is it uncomfortable? Oh my, there's too many people here. Who else is in here? Ooh, let's give an introduction to Brant. <gasps> Hold on. <gasps> Brent and Brant are married? Oh my God. Okay, well, no wonder he didn't want to flirt with us. All right, Jay Huntington, let's do it. Let's brighten your day. Let's give a rose to this guy. It's just like almost too many men. All right, here are the lovers. All right, we have to travel with one of these guys. Jay Huntington, ask about career, a funny story, and then maybe we can flirt a little bit. Oh my goodness. Okay, there's just too many men all in the same area. Is there anyone by themselves? Nope, just chicks. Okay, we gotta go here and then call him over or something. Okay, so now they're by themselves. Um, discuss interests, brighten his day, ask about his career, tell an engaging story. Um, can we flirt yet? Kind of, not really. Oh yeah, he's a trainer. Okay, he's not romantically interested. Why? Is he married to a man too? What? Okay, Ryland is also interested in men only. What the heck? Are there any straight or bi dudes? Ooh, okay, Jay Huntington again. Let's ask him to hang out. Hey Jay, my name is Baby. Do you wanna hang out for a little bit? Yes, he said yes. Okay, we're gonna take him back to the house. Travel with Jay. Stop talking to everybody who is not interested in us. Okay, so we're gonna take him back to our house. Let's go, Jay. You know you want to. Also, I need to start making money ASAP. We have 31 simoleons. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's offer him a rose. Give him a compliment. Discuss interests. Kiss his hands. Oh, he loved it. He just swooned. Ooh, and he's feeling flirty. Yes. We'll ask him a risky question. And then, ooh, she wants to leave a note for somebody. Ooh, she's doing a little pose for him. Oh, he loved it. Okay, confess attraction. I mean, he is not a bad looking sim, if you ask me. Hi, Jay. Baby has to want that. Flirt again. <laughs> We're doing all the things. Oh, first kiss, first kiss. Okay, here we go, here we go. Hurry up. <gasps> They're having their very first kiss. Let's go, baby mama. I knew you could do it. Oh, he loved it. She loved it. Oh yeah, okay. Now we are going to try for a baby. She has learned his woohoo interests and they include baby. So we're gonna get this going right now. This house is super cute, by the way. Okay, she better be pregnant because I can afford two pregnancy tests. Yeah, that's it, just two. Now she's feeling flirty, okay. Needs are good. Now we need to see if she's pregnant. Take the pregnancy test. Not pregnant, no! 
Oh, okay. Oh my God. Try for a baby again. We're just gonna do it until we're pregnant. Oh no, she's getting hungry. Oh no, okay. Is she pregnant now? I can literally afford one more pregnancy test and I'm a little bit nervous. <gasps> she's eating for two. She's eating for two. We're gonna have our first baby. Oh my God, I love it. Now we gotta start writing some books here because we need some money ASAP. All right, we're gonna name this book. Uh, so I'm sure you guys have all heard of WAP, the song. Well, my book is gonna be called WAP, Whiny Ass Baby. Yep. We're doing that. Okay, so we're gonna be writing this book. Oh, and Jay finally left. Thank you. Goodbye. Hopefully this book is good. I can't believe she's pregnant. Oh my gosh. Oh, and she failed to conceive the first time. She's sad about that. Oh. Oh, now she's very flirty. Okay, get it, baby mama. Ooh, and she's writing level two. Nice. We have one. Somalian one. Oh my gosh. Okay. Wow. This book is going to take a while, isn't it? We're almost there. Yes. Okay. So that is done. Let's go ahead and publish. Self-publish whiny ass baby. Wait, what was the quality? Normal. Mm, okay. Yeah. Her writing skill isn't super high yet, but she is hungry. So we're going to have to have a ham and cheese sandwich, I guess. All right, baby mama. Eat that food. And then she's going to have to practice writing or something. Just got to get that skill up. I would buy her a book about writing, but I have no simoleons for that at all. So we're going to have to deal with this. Level three. <gasps> Look at her, she's so pregnant, Oh, Why are you sleeping in this bed? What are you doing, girl? You have this entire room. All right, we're gonna assign the bed to baby mama. Ooh, she's gotta go. So why don't you use the bathroom and you can take a bath. I gotta say, it's really nice and easy only having one sim to take care of, but I better enjoy it now because this is the calm before the storm for sure. Oh, she has a morning sickness, oh man. Looks like the bath is helping, which is good. And then we're gonna have to have her write some more. Is there another way to make money? I don't no. Practice programming, I guess. All right, baby mama, practice your programming and then write another book. Wow, her fun is going up from practicing programming. Ooh, now she can hack and practice programming, which we're already doing. That's a little bit weird. Ooh, okay, so maybe she can be an author slash hacker. That could work. We're gonna have her stop this and write a book. Oh, we need another name. So this is a playful book. So the title is is gonna be bend and snap. Oh yeah, so that is our next book. Let's go ahead and write this so we can publish this as well. We better get some money coming in quick before the bills come in, cause that's gonna be bad. <gasps> she likes writing, yes. Totally gonna say yes to that. Ooh, and she's done with her book. That is what I'm talking about. Okay, so we're gonna have to publish this, bend and snap, and then she can come and eat her applesauce. I don't think that's gonna fill you up, baby. Oh my gosh, we got 11 simoleons from our two books. Are you kidding me? Okay, that's not gonna run a household of eight sims. I'm sorry. We're gonna have to get better at writing really quick. Jay Huntington is calling us. It's good to hear your voice, baby. I wanted to ask you if I should get to know Brant Hecking better as a friend. They seem like good company. I mean, go for it, but I hope you know he is married, so be careful, my dude. <gasps> She's feeling flirty. Can we write a romance book? Oh, we still can't, okay. Uh, well, we can write a short story, so let's do that. All right, short story. This is gonna be called, yeah, that's the name. Once upon a hoe. So let's write this short story. Ooh, writing level four. She can write poems and love emails. The love emails. That is gonna be key, I think. Ooh, who is this man? Ooh, okay. Stop what you're doing, baby. You have to flirt. We gotta get dad number two lined up. Ooh, there's another one. Said I should get going now. You're right here, dude. You are right here. Ask him about love life. Ask him a risque question. Share the big news. Wow, she only has flirty options and I think he likes it. Ooh, look at it. Our romance is going up. All right, and she's gotta go. So why is he embarrassed? Was she too forward? Probably. All right, Brooks, good meeting you. Time to go to the bathroom though. He loves her as only a lover, not really so much as a friend. <laughs> oh well, that's all 
we need is lovers. We don't need any type of man in our life. Well, except for like the five minutes that are here, you know, right? And she's gotta go to sleep. All right, baby mama, sleep it off because you know what you're doing when you wake up? Eating a sandwich and writing some more. That's right. Enjoy your sleep while you can, baby mama, because it's about to get real difficult and real spotty. Okay, so she's feeling uncomfortable. Is she in the second trimester? Second trimester, yes. She's gonna cook eggs and toast? You have no money for that. Oh my goodness. All right, well, I guess you need the cooking skill anyways. So just get this done. The fact that it takes like two in-game hours to make some eggs and toast is crazy. Go to the bathroom and then you can eat your food. Ooh, she's just so nauseous, poor girl. Oh, she wants to chat with Brent. Okay, interesting. Just gonna empty the trash, very nice. And then time to write. Why can't she write jokes? Oh, she's too uncomfortable. Okay, right. Oh, she can't do any of this. She can write a love email to Raylan. We can work on him too. Get her flirting up a little bit. She wants to have a child. Uh, don't worry, baby. That is on the way. Now she's feeling energized, which is great. Now we can resume writing once upon a hoe. Hello? She just puke. Oh, baby mama. All right, you gotta fix that. Okay, now she's better. Resume writing. Once upon a hoe. Oh yeah, she's feeling energized. Come on, it's a short story. I know you can go quicker than this, baby mama. Yes, okay, she's done writing. We are going to publish again. How is the quality? Normal still? Can she write some more? <gasps> she can write a romance novel. Yes, romance novel. What shall we call it? So we're gonna do Hot Mom Summer. That's right, instead of Hot Girl Summer. I'm a big Megan Thee Stallion fan. If you haven't been able to tell by now. I love her. So a lot of my book names are going to be puns off of her songs and you know that kind of idea, that genre. All right baby mama, get this book done. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, she's level five. She can write nonfiction and sell to the publisher and recite love poetry with other sims. Stop. That is so cute. I don't think she finished though. No. Okay. Use the bathroom and resume writing Hot Mom Summer. She's like halfway done. Okay, we got to get this done before we eat. We need those simoleons for the babies. Are you kidding? We got 19 simoleons for three whole books that we wrote. That's just rude. I'm sorry. That is so rude. She still is not done. She wants to eat. Okay, yeah. Wow, I'm surprised animal crackers filled her up so much. I'm not here to judge. Oh man, now she has writer's block, so she can't even write her freaking book. You know what? She's just gonna take a bubble bath. I'm sure that'll get it down really quick. Jay Huntington again is calling us. Baby, thank you for suggesting I hang out with Brant Hecking. We had a spectacular time. Good for you, Jay Huntington. I'm a little bit busy carrying carrying your baby though. So if you could not call me for that, that'd be fantastic. Thank you. So apparently she wanted to drink water. Speaking of, I should probably drink water too. What is she doing? You're just standing there? Finish writing your book. She has to be almost done. Caliente? Okay, Katrina Caliente. Love your name. What I got? Oh, look who wanted to join me. It's my kitty cat. His name is Tyga. He's such a baby. <gasps> she finished writing Hot Mom Summer. Yes. Okay, now we can sell that one to a publisher. I want to see what quality it is. Normal. Okay. Sell to publisher Hot Mom Summer. Hopefully this earns us more than like five simoleons. That's just sad. Yay. Okay, so what is that? Four books already? Wow. We are killing it. You have to mop. Gotta use the bathroom and then maybe she can sleep a little bit. Perfect. She's off to bed and then when she wakes up, we'll have her have a sandwich, of course. She already has to go to the bathroom again. She has to be in her third trimester. <gasps> She's going to be having the baby probably tomorrow. It has to be tomorrow, right? Oh my gosh. I am not ready for baby number one. I mean, I am, but we're going to have 99 more to go after that. I don't know if I'm ready for this. I really don't. Oh, okay. She's chatting with people. Interesting. You are going to not write jokes. You're going to write a genre book, a romance book. All right. This romance book is going to be called. So if you're a Megan the Stallion fan like me, you're going to get this reference. But yeah, it's gonna be called Tot Shit. Even she's laughing. She's like, that name is hilarious. All right, baby, let's get Tot Shit done so we can publish that. And who knows 
when she's gonna be having this baby. It has to be like any second at this point. Oh, what if we get twins? Oh no. I don't know if I can deal with twins. Oh, she's almost done. Oh, get it done before you have to go to the bathroom, please. Ah, oh, yes, we did it. We did it. Time to sell the publisher, tot shit. And then she's gonna go to the bathroom, of course. Probably eat a little bit. We can have another sandwich. Her social is a little bit low. Maybe she can write a little love email to Brooks. I don't know if that helps her social. Does writing love emails help your social? I have no idea. I guess we're gonna find out. Yeah, that did not help at all. Oh, she's chatting with someone. Who are you chatting with? I wanna know, are there any men at all? I mean, technically it could be a woman too, but they just have to be able to get us pregnant. And I'm not exactly sure how to even check if they can get us pregnant or not. So I'm just kind of sticking with the men to play it safe. But all right, we gotta make some more money. She's gonna check her social media timeline. I don't see an option for hacking yet. So maybe we can just have her practice programming. And then she's gonna have to write some more so she can write some poetry. We have to get her a little bookshelf too because we don't have anything in here. Her social is going up though, so that's good. Programming level two, let's go. Okay, so she can hack. Oh my gosh, should we have her hack? Llama corn list, list serve? I don't even know, I can't read. Ooh, she's gonna have to go again. Why is she still practicing? You're good. Ooh, she's feeling flirty. Okay, so this is a poetry book. Where art thou daddy? <laughs> That is what all of my children are gonna be saying. Those poor babies. I'm sorry, babies. Okay, actually, I'm not that sorry. It's pretty hilarious. So you go to the bathroom, baby mama, and resume writing, where art thou, daddy? <gasps> that shit got 32 simoleons. Let's go. That makes me happy. Once upon a hoe is not that successful, and Bob, I thought would be number one, but unfortunately, we're only earning four simoleons a day. I'm a fan of Wob. I don't know what everyone else's problem is, but whatever. <gasps> Baby can now write screenplays. The computer broke. Oh no, we're gonna have to repair that. You gotta learn how to repair. That handiness skill needs to kick in right now because we have 107 simoleons and a baby is about to pop out of us at any second. There we go. Handiness skill has been acquired. Wired. Oh, and she's sleeping. Okay. Yeah, she probably needed that. Jay Huntington, what do you want? Eliza Radford has asked me out on a date? I mean, sure. It's not like I was gonna have you move in with me anyways, but rude. What the heck is on her bed? What? is that? Oof, her needs are looking a little bit rough. Yeah, you sleep and then go to the bathroom and then eat a sandwich. <gasps> and she's gone into labor. Repeat, baby has gone into labor. Baby is having a baby. Oh my God. Okay, let's have her pee first because she's got to go. And then we're gonna have the baby. Oh my God. Have the baby at the hospital. Ah! Our first baby. I got 99 problems and they're all babies. Oh my God. Okay. All right, I guess I, I don't really know what to do. I haven't done this that much. Uh, check in and then what? Do we just go back? She dislikes easy listening music. Uh, no. Fine, I'll just say yeah. Hello, I'm about to have a baby. Can you help me? Is she okay? Okay, now what? Is she just going back? Is that our doctor? Ooh, she's going into the room. Okay, okay. We are having a baby. I repeat, we are having a baby. Ah! Oh my God, is it gonna be a boy or a girl? Oh my God, why? Ew, what is coming out of us? What is happening? What is that? I don't like that at all. <gasps> it's a girl. Oh, what a baby. Okay, so my idea for the baby names is just to go A through Z in order and cycle that probably, what, four times until we hit 100 babies. So starting with A and a girl, we're gonna name her Aria. I've always liked that name. So let's name her Aria. Oh my God. Okay, so we just had the one. That's pretty good. Oh, she's gonna cuddle the baby. Aw, let's rock her. Oh, look at her. So cute. Now she's in her hospital gown. Interesting. And our baby disappeared. So I guess we can go home. Aria's been sent to daycare. Why? Okay, well, ooh. Oh, wait, you're an elder. Sorry, Dennis. All right, where's our child? Oh, there she is. Oh, little 
baby girl. Let's make a silly face and we'll coo at her. And then we're gonna have to eat something and it's gonna be a ham and cheese sandwich. Kind of like me, I eat a sandwich almost every day for lunch and I have no regrets. What a baby, oh my goodness. Wow, the layout of this house, by the way, is perfect. Look at how many beds we have in here. Although the fact that we only have a tub and no shower anywhere is a little concerning. I might have to make some adjustments later on, but luckily by then we should have some more simoleons to our name. So that shouldn't be too much of an issue, hopefully. All right, baby mama, she's going to eat and then she has to write some more. So we're going to resume writing, where art thou daddy? I'm sure Aria is already asking that question. And sorry, Aria, your daddy's on a date. That is where art thou? Okay, well, he's a teen. Why aren't there any adult men walking in front of my house? That is so rude. Baby mama is writing her book. Aria is just chilling like a good little baby. She's so cute. Oh, now she's sleeping. Come on, baby mama, get that book done. You're only halfway done. All right, baby's crying. Stop writing. Stop what you're doing. We have to take care of the baby. We're gonna change the diaper. We're gonna breastfeed. We're gonna coo. We're gonna cuddle. We are gonna rock. This baby is gonna be so happy. And Aria, you better appreciate this because no other babies are gonna be getting this type of attention and care. I'm 99% sure. <gasps> also, we have to get pregnant again. Oh my goodness. Okay, what am I doing? We're wasting precious time. Um, Invite to hang out at current lot. Should we do, let's just do Brooks. He has the highest romance bar. We're gonna invite Brooks over to make baby number two. Oh, that's right. And we have a birth certificate. So what is gonna be the birth wall? Maybe right here by the front door we can start it. We definitely cannot fit 100 here, but we don't have 100 babies yet, thankfully. All right, she's parenting level two. Very nice. Baby is taken care of. Let's just invite over our next lover. And then she's gotta change her outfit. You gotta look a little bit cuter. We'll just do this like everyday one. Why are you crying already? Are you kidding me? And he's sleeping? Oh, it is like midnight. So the the baby is fine, I think. Wait, is the baby stinky? What is going on? She's going to the bathroom. Baby is fine. Let's go to sleep. They're both sleeping. Perfect, perfect. Hopefully by the time we wake up, we can invite over Brooks and get pregnant ASAP. Oh no, oh no, baby's crying, baby's crying. Get up. Oh, she wants to flirt with Brent. Girl, Brent does not want you. We need that trash can that earns you simoleons for throwing things away, but isn't it like 1200 simoleons? I don't think that's gonna happen anytime soon. Little baby. Okay, baby's fine, baby's fine. Uh, we're gonna throw this away for mama and we're gonna have another sandwich. And she's feeling flirty. Okay, so she has to invite Brooks over. He's gotta be up by now. Oh my God, Aria's birthday is tomorrow. Oh my goodness, that was quick. Brooks Holloway will be right over. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, where is he? Oh, wow, so quick. Why is he? upset. Recite love poetry. Ask him about his career. Let's try to calm him down. He seems a little tense. Ooh, he is mad. Okay. Want to get out your aggression with me, Brooks? Kiss his hands. Let's try to brighten his day. And then we can flirt. Ooh, she is feeling flirty. Whoa, what's going on? Why aren't they hanging out? Their friendship meter is like not very high. Brighten his day. Let's just like try to become more friends with him. I don't know what his deal is. Joke about politicians. Ask about career. He's a stay at home dad. Uh oh. Oh no, baby is upset. All right, we gotta help the baby. Change dirty diaper. We're gonna breastfeed and then all over. <gasps> Hot shit got us 37 simoleons. Let's go, 212. All right, baby's happy. Okay, can you put the baby down? All right, let's ask him if he's single. Ask a risque question. Oh, sitting on the bed, first kiss. <gasps> Brooks is married, oh no, this is bad. 
This is bad. Well, okay. I'm gonna justify this by saying we're not even interested in any type of relationship. We just need him to be a dad. So hopefully his wife can look past that. I don't really know. <gasps> They're kissing. Okay, okay. Oh my God, they kissed. Oh my gosh. Ooh, okay, whisper seductively. And then we're gonna try for a baby. All right, Brooks, give me a baby. Let's see, is she pregnant? Okay, take a pregnancy test. <gasps> She's pregnant. She is pregnant. Oh my goodness. Yes. Okay. And send him home. We don't need you anymore, Brooks. So I think this is a great spot to end this first episode. Oh my goodness. That was really fun. I'm going to save and we're going to exit for now. Wow. That was a lot. Even for the first episode, this is going to get crazy. I can already tell, but it's so fun. I just have to say this is going to be a lot, a lot of fun. So I'm excited to take this on. I think my chances of successfully completing this challenge are like less than 1%, but I'm still going to try, damn it. So if you want to join me on this journey, please subscribe so you can see all the rest of the videos that I post for this challenge. And if you want to try it for yourself, again, the link is in the description. So before I let you guys go, just a couple more things. If you would please, please subscribe and support me and my channel. I'm still trying to get this channel monetized. It's been a grind. So if you could just help me out, I would really appreciate it. Also, I am going to start streaming on Twitch. When I do any type of Sims builds or even some Animal Crossing, I might start streaming over on Twitch instead of YouTube just to kind of diversify my following a little bit because if there's anything I've learned is that you can't rely on just one platform forever. If you want to follow me on Twitch so you can see my first live stream there, the link is also in the description. Description. But I hope you have an amazing rest of your day and week and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!